Jesus. This is the Banca Pro Family Kayak. It seats two to three people, recommended two adults and one child. Here are some of the things that I'm throwing in with the kayak. So the kayak itself costs about 40,000 pesos with shipping and everything. Uh, you can mount it to your motorcycle. As you can see, this is just for mock-up here, but I would hook it up to my frame here. I used to have a different motorcycle when I used this. So it can be mounted. I put bungees and I put pad eyes here so now there's storage in the front this piece here there are four screws already in there you can put a fish finder or any kind of hardware you want to mount to it I made a sail mount as you can see I made a sail for it which I'm throwing in too so the sail is included and this all packs down to about a four foot size so the sail can be taken down and taken apart and stowed easily here are some features of the sail I've got a trailer hitch pin here that comes out, so you can easily take this bar out. The sail comes off. This pole is a painter's pole, so it will extend up and it'll slide back down too. There are two different hatches in this kayak. Here's one of the hatches. Has a net you can put in here to put your stuff like your bag, your phone, whatever you want to put in here that you don't want to get lost. I'll just leave that in the hole. And these are watertight hatches. You've got cup holders right here, and you've got scupper holes everywhere. These are so when the water comes in the kayak, they just go right back out of the kayak. Here's a cool feature. These are for mounting a fishing seat. So you can actually put a bar in here and make your own seat, or you can buy one of the fishing seats they have that'll raise you up, elevate it off the kayak. I mounted a cleat here in the front. This is so you can tie it up, set out an anchor, You've got different fishing rod holders here. So one here, one over here, one in the back right here, and another one back here. You see I mounted another cleat here so you can tie up or set up an anchor. I bought the upgraded seat with the back support, so this is included too. There's a cup holder right in front of the person in the back. There's another setup here. You can see there, those are uh, brass inserts that you can thread bolts into. This is, once again, for a fish finder, for cameras, for any other kind of accessories. Then you've got a large hatch in the back. This hatch opens up and has a bag inside, so you can put stuff in the bag. Or, as you can see, this goes all the way through the kayak. You can put big things in there, too. If you didn't notice it yet, I made a custom trailer for it. The two poles go up through two of the scupper holes and that holds it perfectly balanced in place. So that way you can hook this up to a motorcycle, a bicycle, or anything you want. So once again, everything you see here in the picture is included, except the motorcycle. You've got the trailer, the extra seat, the sail that comes apart and takes down to a small area. And then you've also got these outriggers these outriggers are used for when you're sailing so the kayak doesn't tip if the wind blows really hard. This is a cool feature about this kayak. You can see the mounts here. You can put a trolling motor mount on here or you can mount these into here. Sometimes I put these here. You can see I have holes. I have screws set here. So these can be set right here. So that way it's centered on the kayak. It's all your personal preference, what you like. Another thing I added on this kayak was the rudder. I've got rudder controls here that go up to the cleats to my seat and the seat in front of me. So those are on both sides for controlling the rudder. The rudder can flip up. 
and stay out of your way or if you're sailing or you're paddling you can flip it down and these two cords control that so direct message me if you have any questions there's probably about 50 about 50,000 pesos into this kayak right now I'm selling it cheap guys first one that wants to come and get it